President Buhari, whose jet touched down at about 6.40 local time, was received by members of the Nigerian delegation and diplomats. His convoy drove through dedicated lanes to one of the UN Tower Plaza in Midtown Manhattan. Here, too, were Nigerians waiting to receive him and his wife, Aisha. As the president makes his way in, his special advisor on media speaks on Nigeria's new image. Nigeria has uh, re, 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 like rediscovered herself and has got its place back in the Committee of Nations. There was a time that other countries drew back from Nigeria, but Nigeria is in the warm embrace of almost every part of the world now. So it's a deepening of that relationship. Mr. Adishina also outlines the thrust and import of President Buhari's speech to be delivered during the general debate, which opens on Tuesday. The significant thing for the Nigerian president this year is that he will not only be talking about Nigerian issues, he will be talking about ECOWAS issues because he's chairman of ECOWAS, so everything that affects the sub-region he can bring up at this global forum now. So those issues will continue to be talked about till we have progress made on them. The president is expected to make that speech, which is the highlight of the General Assembly on Wednesday the 26th. From Manhattan, New York City, Ibrahim Adra, reporting for Channels Television News.